Hello, this is Paladin Prepper, and this is an update on the the rabbits. We did the uh, rabbit cage assembly, and now uh, here are they the cages in use. Here's our uh, our buck and uh, two does here. Now there's something I want to uh, kind of throw out there and show you something that I learned that I can't imagine why this is the case, but in these cages here, maybe it's just the rabbits. I don't know. But uh, you see, we have a, a tray here, a nice tray that they provided to uh, to do the obvious, and that is catch the poop down underneath, which that's fine. Uh, and it seems to do that pretty well. Now, occasionally, they will knock out some uh, food and get over here. Uh, it'll get outside. But let me tell you something that they're doing. These rabbits, all of them, all three of these rabbits, when they need to go pee, they don't pee in the cage. No, no. They back their bottom up to to the side here and press their bottom to the side so they pee out here for some reason. You see that? How it's made a stain there? And here? Now, I don't know what that's about, but I'm about to put, uh, about to put a stop to it. So here's what um, I'm going to do. I uh, didn't have a good piece of... Uh, uh, many pieces of plexiglass, but I did have one, and I decided that if I would uh, take a piece of plexiglass and drill a couple of holes in it, and put that on the inside of the cage, that would uh, direct that urine flow downward down into the uh, into the tray. So I'm going to uh, stop for a moment and install that, and then come back. All right, well, now you can see I've installed the, uh, the plexiglass piece in there on the inside and ran it, did it from the outside. I uh, decided I uh, didn't want to give the rabbit the chance to gnaw that thing off. And, in fact, uh, what I can do now is uh, snip these things off here so it doesn't look ugly. Snip it off. There we are. So, um, I'm going to repeat that process. I'm going to have to uh, uh, get some more plexiglass. I suspect I won't have to buy it. I can probably find some pieces in there. And I know that's only one section. I'm going to have to do it all the way around on the inside. But you do what you have to do. And what I've done here, because it's summertime, this is now June, and so what I have here constantly on them, 24 hours a day, is this fan going because even at night it gets humid and of course at night I close up my shop there's an extra door there and there's a door there so there's flow and uh, so anyway I just want to uh, make sure that the rabbits stay cool now I'll tell you something about uh, about this whole situation with with the rabbit poop and of course one of the great things about the rabbit poop is that it's not a uh, it's not something that you have to compost. It's something that you can put directly on your um, on your garden. And so, as you can see, you cover it out here, and uh, and you can see it, slide it directly on on the plants. But the thing is, you can only do that so much. And so, I did choose to over and uh, put some in my compost tumbler and so you can just uh, put it right in there and and I haven't tumbled this and see I dumped it in there and I, I forgot to uh, to turn the tumbler all right there's one other thing that uh, has come up a comment on my uh, on my YouTube channel about about the uh, the rabbits and that is the young rabbits you know I had a fourth cage in addition to uh, to these three cages, the buck and the two does, I also had built this cage, a fourth cage, and uh, and that was going to be for the little ones. And and uh, one of my YouTube subscribers mentioned to me that you know this cage is going to be too small for the little ones. They're, you're going to need more room than that. So I said, well, you'll recall that on my on my uh, winter chicken egg. Uh, 
video, I showed this uh, chicken coop here in the lower level, uh, below my my workbench, and I said, would that be, you know, if I if I did something to, uh, you know, maybe put a chain or something and or fasten this, uh, so there's so there's not a, a gap under here, uh, that would this be suitable? And he said it would. So I think I'm going to kind of make a change here as when the time comes I can start them out I can start them out in the uh, in a smaller cage and then uh, probably probably in short order go ahead and transfer them to this so I can just take this this ramp here and pick it up get it out of the way and uh, and put them in this larger unit well that's about all I have Paladin Preference